in this lesson you will learn how to create a custom field in LM Octane. Let's go to the defect module to see how this could look like. On the defect details, I can see I have here two areas, general and release information, and I would like to create a new field risk in the general area which will appear next to the feature field. So let's take a look how to achieve this. Let's first go to the spaces configuration into the customization of the workspace. Now I am in the workspace customization. I need to select the correct entity. And on the entity, I need to go now to the fields and add a new field which is the risk. Let's say this is uh, overall risk. It is a list field and I can now select a value for the list from the available list options I have here. So I can say, okay, I would like to use the same value like we have in the severity list. And that's it. And on the bottom, I can also decide where I need to add this field to. So I would like to apply this field also in the um, form custom for edit, which I have created. And let's say add. And now this field is added to my workspace in ALM Octane. I would like to change the appearance. Let's see where is the field overall risk has been appended to the bottom. I can just drag and drop it to the correct area. And now I have here created a field and reordered it in my default form. By clicking on save, this change should be applied on the workspace. So let's go back and see how it affects my view. So now you can see I'm already in the defect details and I can see here a overall risk which can be selected from the values which I have defined as a list. It is very easy to add custom fields with, with the type, with the preferred type which you need and apply it to your views you have created in LM Octane.